Hi there, so what I'm going to do today, I'm going to talk a little bit about which golf ball is right for you. So you walk into the shop now, I mean, stroof, there's hundreds now, aren't there? I mean, we've got manufacturers coming out from everywhere. Um, they're all doing seven or eight different golf balls. I mean, this compression, that compression, it's interesting. They all got a different compression machine. So, so I don't know, Titleist say theirs is this. Uh, I actually don't think Titleist do, but Trixler the say theirs is that. Is it that? They say that. You know, Bridgestone say theirs is that. They do, yeah, but if you put that ball in that machine, it'll be different as well. So, gonna try and simplify the golf balls for you. We're gonna make it so, what golf ball is correct for you? Now, believe it or not, contrary to what a lot of people think, they think swing speed is the most important. Listen, it plays its part, but it isn't the most important at all. Okay, so, if you think about a golf ball, we're led to believe that the harder the golf ball, the less it spins. So if you want to wheel spin your car, do you let air out your tyres? No, you don't. You'd pump them right up, wouldn't you? You'd make them rock hard. Then it's going to wheel spin like a champ. Yeah, you don't want the wheel spin like you're in the bush. You deflate them, don't you? So that lets us to believe, hang on a minute. So a softer golf ball actually spins less. And if you do some testing, you'll find out that it does. It goes flat on the face, then it goes long, then it goes back to round. It's dispersed. So it's actually going to spin less. If you over compress it, then you're going to lose a bit of ball speed. But so that's going into a video that I'm going to do where I'm going to go through the golf balls of the decade and just see how they've matured their ball speeds and everything. That's a whole different one. That'd be, that'd be a bit of a, a sit down with a beer and have a watch because that'd be fun. But this time, I'm just going to talk very quickly about when you walk into the shop, I just want to choose a box of golf balls and go. Uh, and I don't want to be in for a degree. So quickly, it's how you come in to the golf ball. So if you come a little bit out to in path face is slightly open that means you've got a bit of a cut swing okay so we've got a bit of a cut swing so if you use the golf ball that's really hard it's not going to stay on the face for very long and it's going to have an access spin the spin not about the big spin that'll look after itself if you hit it at the middle of the golf club i'm talking about the access spin side spin if you want to call it makes it easier you're going to create a lot so off it goes so it's not going to stay on the club face for long so if you use the slightly softer golf ball, it's gonna actually stay on that face for a little bit longer. So therefore, it's actually gonna give you a slightly squarer shot. And if you use the really soft golf ball, it's gonna stay on the face for even longer. So if you find, if you've got a cut swing and you find that the golf ball is, is really going out to the right, maybe if you're a right-handed golf, obviously, sorry, lefties. So if you go out there, Go to a slightly softer golf ball. Try a couple of holes. You might find that it starts a little bit further left and comes back. If it's still a bit, then go a bit softer. If it isn't, then go straight. Don't worry about that big spin figure so much. Yeah, Straight is always good. If you can get the softer golf ball going a bit straighter, brilliant. Now, what happens if you come in the other way and you draw the golf ball? So if the golf ball now is too soft, it's gonna stay on that club face for longer, you might find you then hook it. So then you might wanna go a little bit harder. Don't worry about your club head speed. We're just talking about what golf ball's gonna go a bit straighter for you. And straighter, listen, that's always where you wanna be on a golf course, isn't it? You know, it's it miles, but in the crap, eh? No, let's go straighter. So if you've got a draw swing into, into out, you want to go a little bit harder on the golf swing. Even if your swing speed is slower, it will help you. We'll straighten it up. Too soft golf ball, going to work it. Cutter, too hard, exaggerates the slice. So that's what I've found in my experience. And that's just a quick one. So you know your shot shape. Don't be lured in by marketing. Go for what golf ball is going to work for that. Any of, any of the shops is going to do a ball fitting if you ask for it. They'll do that free of charge, no problem. Let's hit a couple, have a look to see which one's good for you. But that's just a quick one. Uh, like I said, I'm going to go into it in a lot more detail, but just a quick one. Yep, if you've got a little bit of a cut, go slightly softer. A little bit of a draw, slightly harder. All right.